gonna happen at that time I saw everything when you stood here before did you see it too? Something behind you. Three days left. It's morning time, I guess? Old computer, do you want to play blackjack? No. New message. Hey Kappa, it's Mommy. How you doing? Are you eating well? I was hoping I could make it back to see you today, but it's the last day of a big furniture sale and I just can't resist a good bargain. You can take care of yourself for a few days, right? After all, you're a big boy now. Remember to finish those your chores before I get back. I left you a list on the table next to your door. Okay, that's it for now. Mommy loves you. Bye-bye, honey. Zzz. You don't feel like doing your chores right now. Okay. Hello? Hello? Kappa? Are you there? Do you remember me? Oh, do you remember me? It's your old friend, Kel. So I, uh... I noticed the for sale sign in front of your house. And I, uh... Heard from my mom that you were moving away soon. I was wondering if you wanted to hang out one more time before you go, or whatever. For old time's sake, you know? Mm. What would you like to do? Open the door! Come on, say hi to Kel, please! It's Cal! It's Cal! Oh my god, we did it! It's... it's Cal! Whoa! You actually came out! Uh... I... I mean... Okay, I'm gonna be honest with you, Kappa. I really didn't expect you to come out today, so I don't really have a big game have a game plan here. Oh, I know. Let's go to hobbies. It's the hobby shop up in the in the faraway plaza. You remember the way, right? We used to go there all the time when we were kids. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go. I w oh, we're no longer in the- that whole thing was the prologue. You shouldn't walk in the street, Kappa, that's dangerous. Sorry, look, I like to live life on the- on the- I like to live life on the- on the wild side. 
It's a doge. Wait, hold up, Cap! I know it's been a while since you've been over at my place, uh, but now might not be a good time. <laughs> okay. Let's just go. I have no clue where I'm going. Cal, would you like to lead the way? Oh, Hobbies. Oh, we found it. Come on, Kappa. Let's go to Hobbies first. Oh, there! I just saw Space Boyfriend! Oh, that's where... Is this where he's from? Well, here we are at Hobbies. It's, it's probably been a while since you were here. Uh, but it hasn't really changed all that much. It's all the same old stuff. Captain Space Boy games, sweetheart movies, a few pet rocks. Oh, hell yeah, pet rocks! Space Boy and... Oh, interesting. Except now they're vintage. Actually, since we're here, I should probably buy a gift for Hero. He's in college right now, but he should be coming back sometime tomorrow. He's studying to be a doctor, so maybe I should buy him some medicine? No, that's a horrible idea. Yeah, you should pick out the gift, Kappa. Let's look around and see what there is. Hmm. Small figurines. Eh, uh, I've always been fond of these little guys. Hero would get mad at me for spending so much money on them, though. Let's not remind him of that. Chock full of comics. Looking through these comics brings back so many memories. Just like old times, huh, Kappa? Hero was never too interested in comics, though. Colorful CDs. Maybe you could play the magic box. These CDs look pretty cool, but I think Hero would appreciate something more sentimental. Let's keep looking. Hmm. Poster for a new game where you can travel across different worlds. Nothing you haven't seen. Vending machine. Okay, yeah, just comics. Called Captain Space Boy's Advent Space Adventure. Plus a dollar to play. Hey, Kappa, let's get Hero's Gift first. Oh, uh, we can play later. Cardboard cutout. Bunch of small figurines, yeah. Ooh, this. Yes! This is perfect! Pop with chips, chip off the old block cookbook. Wow, that's a mouthful. Hero had a copy of this when we were kids, but our dog, Hector, destroyed it. Oh, Hector! He's gonna be happy. He's gonna be so happy when he sees this. But before that, we need to ask the most important question. How much does it cost? Twenty dollars? This is extortion! Shoot, I left my wallet at home. Er... Uh, can you spot me, Kappa? I'll pay you back, I promise. Thanks, friend. I knew I could count on you. Took Hero's gift off the shelf. Hey, shopkeeper! We'd like to buy this cookbook, please. Kel, how have you been, buddy? It's been a while since you've come around, hasn't it? Ah, that's Papa Chips off the... That's Papa Chips Chip off the old block cookbook. I see you have good taste. Yeah, my brother used to follow his recipes all the time. His cookies were my favorite. It's rare that I see another pop... Another fan of Papa Chips' work. That'll be $20, please. Thank you, kind sirs. Please enjoy. Got Hero's gift. Thanks a lot, Kappa. I bet Hero will love this. I'm, I'm... I'm extremely unnerved. I'm waiting for things to go bad. So... Where do you want to go now, Kappa? 
I guess there's really not much to do around the suburbs, huh? Oh, how about Far Away Park? Yeah, the park! We passed it on the way here. That sounds fun, doesn't it? Wait, don't go, please! Sorry, dude, can't help you, you're on your own. Uh-oh. There's some commotion going on over there. Let's check it out. This ain't none of my business. If you got beef with her, talk to her yourself, you creep. I'm begging you. Just ask her to give it back. She won't listen to me. Wait. Is that... That's Basil. Wait, what? Leave him alone, you bully! Huh? Who's there? Oh, it's just Cal. Mm. Why don't you mind your own business? Well, why don't you go bother someone else, Kim? Psh. Well, aren't you acting all high and mighty? You don't make the rules around here. Oh, what's going on over there? Ooh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hi! Oh my god. Aubrey? Oh, hey, Aubrey. This nerd cowl just showed up and thinks he can boss me or thinks he can boss me around. Let's show him what's what. Cal, what do you want? Stop messing with Basil. How could you? We all used to be friends, don't you remember? Tell her, Kappa. Kappa's here? Wow, it really is you. It's been a while, but you haven't changed a bit. How long has it been since you left your house? Three years? Maybe four? Must have been nice to live in your own little bubble. Watch it, Aubrey. You don't know what he's been going through. Hmm. Whatever. Aubrey? Please, listen to me. Oh, you. Hey, stop that. Leave it alone, Cal. This isn't your problem. What the heck is wrong with you, Aubrey? Kappa? Come on, we gotta do something. <laughs> Are you guys really picking a fight? Sure. Why not? The two of you against me. How's that sound? Come at me. I'll take on both of you. Uh... I'm afraid. I'm in danger. First aid kit. Heals 150 heart. Um... Removes emotion and heals some heart. I guess attack? It's 28 damage. Spits on your shoes. Oh, holy shit! Yeah! What the? Is, is that a knife? What the fuck? Oh shoot, Aubrey, are you okay? You're you're hurt. I'm fine. No, you're not. You're bleeding. Come on, we gotta get you out of here. Ah, I'll get you back for this.
Whoa, that was about to get really messy. Good thing you had your knife there or we would have... Well, wait a sec! Give me that! Take away your steak knife. You shouldn't be carrying things like things around like this, Kappa! That's dangerous! Ugh. Aubrey's really changed since you last saw her. Her and her new friends have been nothing but trouble. Poor Basil. Let's check if he's okay. Wait, so Basil is actually... he's okay? Hey, Basil. How are you doing? Ah, uh, I'm fine. Thank you, Kel. I don't know if you noticed, but Kappa's here too. Say hi, Kappa. Oh, hey, Kappa. It's been a while, hasn't it? Uh huh. Woohoo! What a happy reunion! So, did you want to hang out with us today? Uh, oh. I'm sorry. I'd love to, but I... I should probably head home. Huh? Really? Are you sure? My, um... My grandma hasn't been feeling too well lately. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Let us at least walk you home. It's been so long since we've all hung out. Uh, oh! Uh, all right then. Thank you. Okay, it's this way. Oh, all the flowers! Well, that's cool. There's Basil's house. It's that one with the green roof. Um, thanks for walking me home. No problemo! If you ever need anything from me, just ask, okay? We'll catch you later, Basil. Uh, okay. Uh... Wait! Please don't go! Uh, I mean... I... I'm so sorry! I actually have a favor to ask! Anything, Basil. What do you need? Well, you see, something important was taken from me. When we used to be friends. You remember I used to take pictures of everyone? Of course I remember. Those photos meant everything to you. Ah, uh, right. Well, Aubrey, she took my photo album and... Aubrey stole your photo album? Well, she... she won't give it back. What a scumbag! Don't worry about a thing, Basil. Me and Cap got you covered. Okay, that's... that's absolutely fucked up. Oh my god. How could you do that to an old friend? Uh, okay, thank you. Like, what the hell? By the way, about what you said before. We're still friends. I want you to know that, okay? Okay. Well, I'll see you later. Come on, Kappa, there's no time to lose. We got a photo album to find. Let's check Far Away Park for clues. Hello? This tree is shaking. Hmm, looks like Aubrey isn't here. Oh wait, I know, your name's Charlie, right? I see you hanging around Aubrey sometimes. You know where she is? You know, Charlie. I can tell you're not really the mean type of person. Aubrey took something from Basil. We need to get it back. Is there any way you can help us?
Whoa, what? And where now? What'd you do that for? Ah, if it isn't Kel and that weird knife guy. Worthy, advers worthy adversaries for the great mighty angel. Finally, it's the time for you to meet your doom. Angel, we don't have time for this. We just want to find Aubrey. You know where she is. You seek Aubrey, do you? Interesting. I will tell you what I know. But first, you must best me in battle. The battle? But I don't... I don't want to punch a kid. You won't be able to lay a finger on me. Come on! Let's stick him, Charlie! Uh. Oh my god! This is, um... This is, um, the, the headbutt kid at... The headbutt kid and the, the, the big big kid. Oh, it's those two. Interesting. Alright, well, I guess we're going straight for Angel. Well, we just laid a finger on you. Charlie's just standing there. Oh, wow, yeah, no, we're gonna ruin him. Cal just keeps beating him in the head <laughs> with the ball. Heh, <laughs> you'll surprise me, Kel. You would make a worthy rival for my master. Alright, well, there we go. You'll pay for this. How could this be? My training was all for nothing. I hope my head hurts. You're the one who started it. You bully. Ugh. Okay, Angel, it's time to be serious now. We beat you and Charlie, so tell us where Aubrey is. Hmm. A promise is a promise, I suppose. I will honor my word and tell you what I know. The truth is, Aubrey is somewhere in faraway town. Probably. Dang it, Angel! You better not be messing around or else. I told you I'd tell you what I know. And the truth is, I don't know anything. Angel, you better tell us where she is now. Or else I'll tell everyone about that time you wet your bed at summer camp. Huh? You can't do that, it's cheating. Anyway, I really don't know. Maybe you can ask my master, the Maverick. He's the keeper of all knowledge. He told me that himself. The, the Maverick? Oh no. You mean that weird kid, Michael? Don't you dare call him by that name! He would take great offense to that. I see. So, is it him? Where can I find me cat? I mean, the Maverick. I'll tell you what I know, but you'll have to fight me first. Or I can tell everyone about the time you... Yeah! Okay, fine. I'll talk. Master went to the fountain at the faraway plaza. Said he was going to meet some girls there for a date or something. Ugh. Disgusting. Come on, Kappa. Let's go to faraway plaza. I think we're done here. Okay. So, Far Away Plaza. Isn't this Far Away Plaza? 
Oh yeah, there we go. Maverick. Then I told him, it's not Maverick. It's Maverick. Oh, the Maverick. You're so funny. Uh. Oh, yeah, wow, what an amazing story, the Maverick. Girls, girls, please. There's enough for me to go round. Mikhail, what are you doing? Ah! If it isn't Kel, my arch nemesis. Finally here to admit defeat, are you? I don't have time for this, Mikhail. We're looking for Aubrey. Have you seen her around? Stop calling me that! I cast away that, tame, that name a long time ago. Mikael, do you know where she is or not? Again with that godforsaken name! How dare you make a fool out of me! I, the Maverick, will not stand for this. Prepare to face your doom! Watch this, ladies. I'll wipe the floor with this loser. Please, Mikael, don't do this to yourself. I'm gonna ask one more time. Bite me, you wad! Don't be a chicken! Ugh. Are we really gonna do this? Okay then, come on Kappa, let's take him down. We're just beating up all the kids, aren't we? The Maverick. Oh, Kel, you pitiful fool. You don't stand a chance against the Maverick. Hmm, not bad, but this fight's just getting started. As expected of my rival, but I must tell you, while you were fully around at playing sports, I was honing my techniques just for this moment. You'll never reach my level of skill, you're going down. Kel feels angry. Oh. 50 what? <laughs> ha! Is that all you've got? I've only been using 10% of my power. Behold! My final form. I bet you're regretting your decision now. I'm just way too cool for you. You're nothing but a loser! <laughs> This dude has, like, some Black Knight energy, um, from Monty Python. <laughs> Just, like, no matter what's actually happening, like, wait, is- Are you gonna say the line? It's only huh, a matter of time before you tire yourselves out. No, I was gonna- I thought it was gonna be, like, I thought he was actually gonna say, It's only a flesh wound. My victory is imminent. Maverick takes, uh, or Maverick, sorry, takes 20 damage. Huh, <sighs> I'll admit, I'm impressed, but you're still light years away from defeating me. <laughs> Fucking free eye. Huh, huh, no, this is impossible, improbable, absolutely inconceivable. Yeah, no, I won't let it end like this. No, it can't be over for me. People of Earth, lend me your strength. Yeah. Ew. What is with this guy? He's so lame. This isn't worth ten. This isn't worth ten dollars. Let's get out of here. Oh my god! Did you pay them ten bucks? <laughs> Ladies, please come back. I have more money.
Mikhail? There's no one by that name. Please, I'll never ask you for anything again in my life. Just tell us where Aubrey is and we'll go. Okay, fine. I do happen to know where she is, and I'll tell you, on one condition. You must call me by my true name, the Maeve Ri- Well, forget it. Let's just go find Kim. She probably knows where Aubrey is. Her and Vance are major sugarheads, so I have a hunch they'll probably be somewhere near Candy. <laughs> Hmm. Huh, 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 huh. Drink orange juice. Have you ever heard the phrase orange is the happiest color? No? Well, that's fine. Just know that the same concept applies to orange juice. It has vitamin C, it is which is essential for healthy immune system functions. It's also an antioxidant that ma that may have health benefits by protecting your cells from free radical damage. So would you like to buy some orange juice for two dollars? Yeah. Okay. Uh, how much does that? Apparently better than apple to- oh. Well. Okay. It's mostly full of orange- I don't- I see grapes, apples, and bananas there. See, somewhere near can- yeah. Hmm. Knowing Kim and Vance, they're probably somewhere around here. Oh, there she is. Hurry, Vance, let's shove it all in our pockets before someone sees it! Hey! Gilb! Have you seen Aubrey anywhere? Shoot! It's that nerd, Kel! Come on, Vance, we gotta go. Whoa! Hold on there! I don't think you paid for those. Get out of my way, nerd! You don't know me! Hold on, I'm not here to snitch! I just need to find- we just need to find Aubrey! You know where she is? Huh? huh? Aubrey? I don't know anything- I don't know anything about that. Even if I did, I wouldn't tell you. Ugh. I've had enough of this for today. Gib, let's make a deal. You tell me where Aubrey is, and I won't turn you in for stealing all that candy. Thought you weren't a snitch. I don't need to be if you just tell me where Aubrey is. You two again? I thought I told you never come back in here, smiley smiley. Uh-oh. Hand over the stolen candy. Don't make me call the cops on you kids, smiley smiley. We've been busted. Fine! Here's your stupid candy! Come on, Vance, let's get out of this dump. Ha <laughs> ha! Serves you right! Wait. How will we find out where Aubrey is now? Ugh. Come on, Kappa, let's follow him. Hi, hi! It's me! The happy and cheerful Miss Candace! What would I? What would you like today, Smiley Smiley? Sweet chocolate, yes, chocolate. How many would you like? I get two candy. And I'll get I'll get some chocolate as well. There we go. Come again, or I'll oh, oh. What's up here? No, we can't go up there, apparently. Hmm. Hold up one sec, Kappa. I think I have an idea. 
Hmm? Sorry for the hold up. Let's go catch up to Kim and Van. Did you just buy candy? You don't... I thought you didn't have your wallet. Hello there, this is Cucumber in Post reminding you to like, comment, and subscribe. If you're looking for something to comment, then something as simple as for the algorithm will help greatly. Now then, without further ado, back to the episode. You! Grumble, grumble. Sorry, Vance. No candy today. No. Not again. I don't know how much longer I can last. We're going to die. Ah, let's just go home. We're gonna be late for dinner. Wait, Kim! I have something for you. You again, Cal? What the heck do you want, you bully? Tell us where Aubrey is, and I'll give you this whole big bag of candy. Really? The whole bag? I mean, wait. You can't buy us off with candy. What do you take us for? I don't know, Kim. We haven't had candy for an entire week. There's a whole bag right in front of us. We don't even have to pay for it. Can you at least ask if they have any taffy in there? Stop it, Vance. We have to stay strong. When we go to Dad's house, we'll be able to have all the candy we want. Okay. I'll do it for you, sis. Kim, Vance, I'm waiting. Heh, <laughs> like we'd accept candy from a bunch of nerds. Oh, man, really? I was sure this would work. What a waste of time. Let's get out of here. Wait. Please, Kim, you're the only lead we've got. Please, take the big bag of candy. We, we even, we have Taffy in here. Did someone say Taffy? I see. That changes everything. Fine, you really want to know that badly, huh? Let's settle this with our fists. If you win, I'll tell you where Aubrey is. But if we win... You give us that bag of taffy, and never talk to us ever again. Wait a sec, there's no need to fight. If you just tell me where she is, I'll give you this whole bag. But, I, I want to fight. Come on, put them up, you two. It's time to duke it out. Ugh. What's with you guys in fighting? Well, I guess we have no choice. Come on, Kappa, you know the drill. I'll show you that size isn't everything. I'm not about to lose to nerds like you. Dang, all I wanted was some taffy. Grumble, grumble. Grumble, grumble, grumble. <sighs> I can't believe we lost. We can never let Aubrey know about this. Come on, Kim, we gotta get home. Come on, Kim, we gotta get home. It's almost time for dinner and Mom's gonna be really mad if we're late. Shoot, let's get out of here. Wait, where do you think you're going? We won! You need to tell us where Aubrey is! Oh, yeah, that's right. Aubrey's at the church. The one near her house. Oh, huh? Aubrey's at church? Hey, don't look at me. You're the one who wanted to know. Also, if she asks who told you, tell her it wasn't me. Say it was... Mikhail or something. Come on, Kim, we gotta scoot. You know how Mom gets when she's l when we're late. Yeah, yeah, I hear ya. Let's go. Smell you later, nerds! I 
just realized that. Hold on, I'm gonna. Oh, nuts. They took the big bag of candy when I wasn't looking. Those two have got some sticky fingers. Oh, well. At least we know where Aubrey is now. Or at least I think we do. I can't really imagine Aubrey at church. But I'll believe it when I see it. Okay, well, let's go. Oh, okay. I guess that's them. Well, here we are. This is really the last place I'd expect her. I'm kind of skeptical, actually. It might be a trap. I'll open the door a little to just take a peek. Mm, looks normal to me. I think they're in the middle of a sermon. Oh, she's the one on the right. Hmm, she's just sitting there, all normal. So weird. I'd feel pretty bad about interrupting this. We should probably wait until the sermon is over or something. Whoa, I didn't expect you to just walk in like that, Kappa. Well, there's no turning back now. Well, we have to be really quiet. She's there on the right. Let's walk to the pew behind her. Aubrey. Psst. Aubrey. What the? What, what, are, what the heck are you guys doing here? We want, we want you to give back Basil's photo album. You're still on about that? That's none of your business. Really? None of my business? We all used to be best friends. But now, this is none of my business? Yeah, Cal, exactly. We used to be friends. You know, Mary would be really sad to hear that. <sighs> really? You really want to bring Mary into this? Who cares what Mary thinks? Mary's dead. Wait, what? Mary's dead? What the hell? Little oh, Breeze. Seriously? What's wrong with you? I get that you have now. F you have new friends now, but you can't just forget your old friends like that. My old friends? My old friends weren't there when I needed them. So that's what this is all about. When Mary passed on, we were all dealing with our own stuff. We were kids. It was hard. You think it's all so simple? You're all- you've always been simple, Cal. So what if I am? I'd rather be simple than be like you. How could you do that to Basil? You know how important that his photo album is to him. It's important to all of us. That doesn't mean you can just steal it. Is that what Basil told you? I'm the one keeping it safe. What are you talking about? The photo album belongs to Basil, and I'm not leaving until you agree to give it back. Ugh. You're so persistent. When Mary died, you moved on so fast. You know why I come here every week? Even after all this time, I'm still trying to find some peace. But it doesn't look like that's happening today. We haven't talked in four years, Kel. A lot changes in four years. You and Kappa think you can just barge into my life and tell me what to do? Don't be so naive. You might look different and act different, Aubrey. But you're still the same person. Huh. The Aubrey you knew is long gone. And the Aubrey that you, that was your friend 
She's long gone too. Fine. I get that you're angry. Look, if it's an apology you want, here. I'm sorry, okay? I should have been there for you when we lost Mari. No. I won't accept this. Wait. Where are you going? I can't let you go until you promise you'll give Basil his photo album back, you thief. What's happening? Basil? Not the boy who... Seen Aubrey and her friends bully. Oh. Oops. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! You think you're the good guy, don't you, Kel? And I'm the big bad bully. Here to terrorize poor defenseless Basil. You're the one hanging out with the psychopath who carries around the knife. Now's not the time to do this, Aubrey. You don't get to say that. You're the one who barged in here. I already said I was sorry for everything. If you want me to be a bully, then I'll be a bully. You two better come at me quick. Or I'll come at you first. Um, Aubrey, you're literally in the middle of a church. Holy shit. Look at her clothing. It's completely inappropriate for church. Aubrey, what are you doing? Uh, please, Aubrey? Serves you right, Cal. Now, leave me alone. Since her father left, she's so uncontrollable, disrespectful. I feel bad for her mother. Shoot. I know she's been kind of messed up lately, but I still feel sorry for her. Maybe this was a bad idea. God. What the hell? Did we at least get the photo album? Did you see that? Aubrey just dumped something into her trash can. Let's check it out. Whoa, I don't believe it. It's Basil's photo album. Can't believe she would just throw it out like that. It's a good thing we looked through the trash can. Yeah, Cal the Trash Goblin saving the day. But on the bright side, at least we have Basil's photo album now. It only took us half a day, too. Talk about teamwork. How about a high five, Cap? A high five, Cal? Oh, absolutely! Hell yeah. A pie. Let's give this back to Basil before it gets dark. He'll be so happy when he sees it.
Knock knock! Basil! It's your friends, Kel and Gappa! Oh, hello there. Who are you? Hi, Basil. Oh, wait. You're not Basil. Ah, oh, I'm sorry. My name is Polly. I'm Basil's caretaker. Oh, hey, Kel. What is it? Hi, Basil. We got your photo album back. Huh? Huh? You did? Wow. Thank you. Give Basil back his photo album. Basil, you didn't tell me you had friends coming over. Would you like to join us for dinner? I always seem to cook them just a little too much. Dinner? Yeah, sure. Sounds delicious. Come on, get a free dinner. Free dinner and a friend. Hell yeah. Also, I saw that cat on the roof. Please, make yourself at home. I'll go ahead and finish up the food. Well, it's been a while since I've been in here. You definitely have a lot more plants than you used to. Ah, uh, uh, yeah, I like them a lot. Actually, there are some that are still alive from when you guys came here more often. Wow, you sure are dedicated. Yup, that's basil for you. Flowers and photos. Oh, that reminds me. Now that we've got your photo album back, we can go through all we can all go through the photos together. Ah, uh, that's uh I don't know. Been a while since you've looked through them, hasn't it? Come on, it'll be fun. No, reawakening old trauma. Um sh sure. Okay. Don't feel pressured into it, Basil. If you don't feel comfortable, don't do it. Here it is. My first photo. It's my best friend, Kappa, trying out new the new violin. Starting to to take lessons again so he can play at recitals with his sister Mary. So excited. Oh, Mary's a sister. Just Cal being Cal. So many party hats. Kappa playing a video game on the couch. Kappa's a little shy, but he's a really good listener. I always end up venting to him when I get obsessed, upset or stressed. Sometimes I feel like I'm bothering him, but he never seems to mind. I... I... I, I, I actually do that. Like... <laughs> <laughs> that hits close to home! We're back from... We're back from the park, but Cal is still full of energy. Challenged Hero to an arm wrestling match, but we all know how who's gonna win. Please go easy on him, Hero. Oof. Sorry, Kel. Better luck next time. Yo, know, just flex and feel your best. Kel was feeling a little sour about losing to Hero in an arm wrestling in arm wrestling last night, so Hero decided to lean in for a smooch. Kel looks so annoyed. Ah, oh, brotherly love. Me showing Kappa a book I've been reading. Mary stole my camera and took this when I wasn't paying attention. I should really keep better track of my things. It's all of us cuddling with Kappa's stuffed animals. He has so many and they're all so soft. I wish I could just lay here forever. Mary's teaching everyone how to make flower crowns. Here's Cal and Kappa holding Mary's example. It looks perfect, doesn't it? If only Mary thought if only Mary thought so too. You're still making his flower crown. It's taking him a little while, but he's getting there. You have to admire his persistence. It's raining super hard today. 
The rain always seems to come out of nowhere during springtime. Aubrey asked me to take a picture of her with the new raincoat. It's her favorite color, pink. Oh, that's why she has the pink hair. That's cool. Aubrey won't let Kel under the umbrella. But Kel seems to be taking it just fine. He says he'll, he says he likes how the rain tastes. Kel just being Kel again. He went to Hobbies, but the shop owner told Kel to leave his jacket outside since Kel was getting since Kel was getting all his comics wet. Sorry, shopkeep. It's been pretty busy with school lately. But we finally made time to get together and go to the park today. Here's Kel hanging by his hanging by his legs off a tree. He's such a good climber. I wish I was as fearless as him. It's the first day of summer vacation, so we all wanted to celebrate by going to the beach. Watermelon is Aubrey's favorite. Kel is cooling off with some refreshing orange gel. I shouldn't get too close or he might get my camera wet. Kel is known to spill his drinks. We buried Kappa in the sand. It took forever, but it looks like he's enjoying himself. Wonder if he's gonna need help getting out. I guess I'll keep him company until then. Kappa's turning 12 today. Even though B, Kappa, Aubrey, and Kel are in the same school year, Kappa's younger than all of us. Oh. He's the baby of the group, so we have to take care of him. Kappa holding a super huge present from Mari and Hiro. Hmm, I wonder what it is. You can't really tell from the, from the photo, but Mari and Hiro got Kappa a giant building block set. Kappa seems much more interested in the box that mood. Absolute mood! Just acts like... He acts just like Mari's new kitten, Miwu. Kappa won't leave the box, so Kel put a food bowl inside. <laughs> I guess this box will be Kappa and Miwu's new home. We're going beetle catching today. Here's Kel, ready to pounce on his next victim. Oh, and Kappa is there too. He looks kind of sleepy. I went to the bathroom and came back to this photo. Kel says he took a picture of himself on accident, but I don't believe him. It's the first day of school today. Me, Kappa, Kel, and Aubrey are, br are up bright and early. Aubrey is so photogenic. Bye, Summer. Until next year. Yeah, we're done. Oh, man. Looks like a lot of the photos are still missing. Maybe Aubrey kept for maybe Aubrey kept them for herself. We'll have to get those back later. Well, on the bright side, look at how short I was! <laughs> Were there any pictures of Mary in there? Oh, she might have taken them. I know I've grown at least a foot since Hero left for college. I can't wait till he comes back. This year, I'll finally be the taller brother. <laughs> anyway, don't sweat it about the missing photos, Basil. Me and Kappa will take care of things for you. You just focus on going back to your happy, carefree self. Okay. Thank you. I'll try. Sorry about the wait. Dinner is taking longer than I expected. Than I thought. Would any of you boys like to help? Yeah, sure, I'll help. I got some experience helping my brother cook and stuff. Oh, that would be lovely. Please follow me. The kitchen is this way. 